Hey everyone, Miosity here, welcome back. Today we will be going into the shroud on our newest cowardice run, seeing how far we can get. We did fairly well in our sprawl last time, getting quite a few interesting things, but people are quite a bit stressed out, so we're going to see what we can do about that in just a minute. However, we have a few things that we're going to use right off the bat like the ceremonial drum on there's down here so he doesn't get taken in by the hand. Um, I think I'm also going to be using the boxing gloves. I think that can't be used on Sarmenti. It can be used on Bear's Down and Dismas here. Wow, actually I think that's the first time I've seen that be a negative. <laughs> We're going to put the linseed oil fat flask on her for now. And that gives us a few items to toy with. Each improvement. Just putting the unabridged edition there so it's out of the way and we have an extra item. And there's our SA gear in our trap makers kit, giving us a few item slots to play with. We're going to then go to provisioner, seeing what we can get. Definitely getting that whiskey bottle. Uh, because of our pet, I believe that the medical gear upgrades how much he does. Yeah, 10% healing receipts from skills for medical gear item equipped. So we definitely want to get the Embalmic and Retort, which would also gives us uh, concoction powder items. So sure, let's grab this. Grabbing these whiskey flasks. The rigors of the road. Let's see where we can go from here. Uh, I know that Dismas here had a meltdown. So I'm pretty sure he's un almost unfriendly with everyone he has, so we're going to have to fix that as best we can. So him and Sermenti, I think that's fixed. Him and Vera. Alright. And still need some with Bear's done. And everyone else is at least neutral. So if we go to the Provisioner and grab this book, I think we're going to be good. I think we should probably grab the poetry too to get that stuff up, but I really don't want to grab the pipe weed just because I don't want the uh, speed down for that. Oh, bum leg blocks that too, huh? Interesting. So we will use this on these two. We will then, I think I want to use this lime mold actually um, as bad as the quirk could be on Baristan and Sarmenti. And then we're also going to use the oddly tuned loot. Get all that stress down. Then to the mastery trainer. Mastery. Let's get slice off so that we do extra damage, extra crit, and get the weakness token with it. And also Encore not giving us the damage down token. And that will be it for our mastery stuff. And then, like I said, we're going into the Shroud. The barnacled timbers of the and I believe that is it. I, I do think I'm actually going to pass on the poetry for now. Spending that much for a single relationship up sounds a little silly to me now that I think about it. Otherwise, I think we're good. So let's go to the Shroud and see what happens. Well, at least nothing negative happened. All right. Let's see where this bugger is. Propriety floats listless on the tide. Brian. That's quite a bit right off the bat. And we get a creature den if we go to the lair. I like that. So if we go left, then we can get a cache. Then the lair to a watchtower, which is blah, creature den. Yeah, that sounds like a plan. So the hoarder might have something for us too. We never know about that stuff. Coming. Ooh, scrap grenade. That's actually pretty good. I think I want to grab the wild tea because that automatically gets rid of whatever quirk I need to. And there's quite a few bad ones I need to get rid of here. And I do not see a field hospital here to... Oh, there is, but I'm not going to hit it. So let's grab that. 
Something to ease the rigors of the road. And as good as some of these things are, I'm not going to be able to buy them. Oh, too bad we can't get the Chichurgeon's table. Let's get the whiskey bottle. I'm tempted to buy the stimulants, especially for Dismas. What's, what's he using for this right now? Oh, you know what? Let's buy him. All right, and then we'll, we'll be good. That, that was a good buy. And then we can do this. We can grab those, and then we'll put the medicinal herbs on Sarmenti as a just-in-case to get rid of the bleeding. And then I'm going to go to the cache. I kind of want to go to the hoarder again, but we don't have enough to get anything that I would really need. So the cache is probably the better choice here. And what goodies do we get this time? Oh boy. So we definitely want aren't these. I definitely want the holy water to whetstone the roast pig. And that's what I thought I'm out of room. Let's get rid of the laden lantern. Pick up a spacious storage trunk. And those aren't what I thought they were. Yeah, let's get rid of the neutralizing powder and get Fairly tempted to take these, but I don't see them being infinitely useful, even on Sarmenti if he got more speed. So let's just leave that stuff. Could be bad. This is a den of absolute evil and wretchedness. Prepare yourself. Okay. So I think what we're gonna do is take burn all of them, especially because that burn resistance down is uh doing its job. Surprised he resisted, but nonetheless. Five, five, and five. Wow. Hey. Open the vein on the second pulse. Ooh, stun. We are going since he's er, pair is stunned, not he. Uh, we are going to slice off, and we can only hit this boson. Now it's going to die on its next turn. Retribution, all attacks that can have to go at Barristan. One down, Sarmenti goes again. This time we're going to Encore. Not sure she can... Yeah, that's what I thought. Magnesium Rain didn't refresh because of the stun, but we can still blight this both Warf Rat, not both and dies on its next turn. The other one just gets severely hurt. Incremental, but deadly. We're gonna open another vein on this Bolson. Surprised it didn't bleed. Uh, we are gonna hold the line. Probably didn't kill it. Okay. Magnesium Rain, and that should finish everything but this one off. Which, speaking of, mitigate our damages. Bump. We win. Next round. There's a docker. Alright, let's burn them all. Five, nine, and five. <laughs> that keeps getting me that does so much burning damage. Alright, we're gonna open that vein. 
going to slice off trying to kill this one. Ouch. Retribution. Era is going to plague the nade, trying to kill the back row one. And it burned him as well as blighted. We're going to duel its advance since he got knocked way in the back. He dies on his next turn, so everything can go at this docker. We're going to beat black. And give him a good old crush. And let him bleed. Let's advance again. Fade to black. Now he's at death's door, and I believe he'll bleed out. Now we are a little bit of low health. I'm not happy about that, but that is what it is. Got explosive magazine for chance to produce explosives and stacking for explosives by one. Not too bad. Nautical compass, not a fan of. Lashing tide. Increase stacking for combat items by two per stack. That could be good. In the sodden sweater. I mean, I kind of wanted that on their stock. So we're, we're going to go for it just because of the sodden sweater, to be honest. They must be made to see that their monstrous god is mortal. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to go for the blight, to be honest. Because the blight can still burn. And that way we're doing more damage over time. We're going to Encore so we can Blight more. And this has a chance of dazing it. So let's try to do that. I guess not. Okay. Eight to fifteen. Or this will bleed. We'll do nine damage. Yeah, this does more overall. If we, I should have done the um, fisherman net. Just thought of that. <laughs> All right, here's the hand. Now is when I want to point blank. Come on, resist that bear stun. Good boy. Right, now is when we want a magnesium rain to burn them both. Uh, we're gonna point blank thing. Oh no, it's got five health left, okay. Now the hand's down, nice. So let's. Oh, we can do this. So, strategic withdrawal, putting the combo on. We slice off, getting a bleed. Hopefully. He's gonna pyromaniac bomb. So, what I'm gonna do is this again to get the debuff down. And then we're going to Noxious Blast. Firebomb burn. Slice off bleed. Retribution. Actually also going to stimulate him so that if I have point blank, I can. Oh boy, that's what I did not want to happen. Alright, Magnesium Rain again, burning. This is no time to falter. I swear. <laughs> You're fucking kidding me. Casualties are to be expected. Leviathan's two for two on Sarmenti. Oh, 
Let's just kill the Leviathan. A brilliant conclusion. Cool. <laughs> Or in death. We are all prisoners here. I knew something bad was gonna happen. Loathing whispers. Let's go through this stuff quick. I wanted this for Baristan, putting that on him. I suppose we can put bleed resistance on him, and that's what we can do for trinkets and combat items. So the rest we basically have to toss. <laughs> uh that I don't see myself using it. The nautical compass, no. <laughs> Needs having more items out of here. Spacious trunk. Okay. Thinking about this, we have way too many combat items. Let's get rid of these. Let's get rid of the medicinal herbs and items. Let's get rid of the restorative herbs. Let's get rid of the clotting poultice. Let's get rid of the armor repair kit. Nightshade concoction. Plus the wax and inoculant can go. Much as I hate, the whittling tools can go, and we're good. Reliable Not sure how that creature den is gonna go now. Insight, after all. Oh, you're kidding me. I'm not gonna use either of them. You know, I, I was very tempted to take the Bounty Hunter over Sarmenti just to test him out. And I suppose I really should have. <laughs> Coach's plating is spent. When, when I get those little... Hey, I should do this. I should start listening to it. I really, really should. Actually, the bear trap is kind of fun. One bleed, three turns. Yeah, let's get rid of the gross feet for that strap grenade. They prostrated themselves before the primogenial power of the obelisks and were rewarded for their supplication. I know that they wanted to run, and I probably should have. The creature den stuff can be so good and so rewarding, especially since I just spent two mastery points on Sarmenti and just lost them. I, these two little buggers are going to be my first target since I do not want them mutating. Retribution. That way, my tank is taking most of the damage. We're going to flag grenade, trying to get them down a little farther, or at least getting rid of the blocks. Or dodges, rather. He's gonna die on his turn, so what we're gonna do is open Vein on this one, trying to get it down farther, bleeding it. Hoping it doesn't mutate. Like that. Oh well. It's still pretty hurt. So let's give it a good bonk. Gonna magnesium rain burning them all again. Opening a vein on it, bleeding it, getting rid of that last block. Death death store, it's gonna die on its next turn. Steady yourself. All right, we're going to Retribution so that the rest of the attacks go at Baristan. We are going to heal Dismas. A calculated generosity, but a welcome one nonetheless. That one dies. 
The work continues. I'm gonna open a vein trying to kill the Weber. Paste. Hoping up. that the Carrion Bower dies like that. We're then going to crush on the Weber, killing it. Going to the next no devourers. Good. No one has burn resistance. Not to use the lens seed. Actually, probably should have just to uh, got get the um, blocks away. But whatever. All right. Duelist advance. Get him back in range, so he's doing more damage. Uh oh. We can fix that. We're also gonna. That's only one target, right? Yeah. So we're just going to bend for medicine healing Terra. Getting rid of that blight so she does not die. Hold fast. For who knows? There, keeps getting stunned. That's not great. So let's open a vein on this one because we can know we hit it. Incremental. But deadly all the same. This is going downhill quickly. Fourteen blight. An interminable conflict. I'm gonna take a gamble because we're already going downhill quickly, so we're gonna try to burn them and take a few out. Once again. Barra's at death store, Barra's gonna go to death precious. store. One dead. A righteous Second is gonna die. Yeah, this one is gonna die, so we're gonna go at the spitter. Well done. That's not gonna help. But we can do the oh what? Retribution. Um, yeah, we're, we're gonna retribution so attacks go at him. Since he has health now. Era. Okay. Last attack goes at him. He's on death's door. That's fine. Figured he'd have a meltdown after that. Let's duel advanced. Rushing. Here is still alive. So I can end this if they go first. Or I can potentially <laughs> dismiss if he goes first. Um and I only have a 50% chance to hit, so I'm gonna play it safe. The path of exculpation need not be a lonely one. Self-reliance is a rare and wonderful thing. One down, other is gonna go. And we're gonna lose Barristan, aren't we? I don't see a way of getting to that corpse now. Or to the spider, rather. Another old soldier lays down his life in the dirt of a distant land. Well. For every miscalculation, a consequence. The loathing abates. Suppose we're gonna take that. Or no, I'm not gonna ditch that. Um I, I at, at this point it's just getting to the end and restarting, I think. 
didn't know she could have 10 out of 10 stress. <laughs> Chaos must be met. Just rolling. Unwavering resolve. Well, they can run. I'm fine with that running. They can go to the assistance and... No. Um. Oh boy, this is uh, doomed if I do, doomed if I don't. So let's go to the hoarder because that's going to be the easiest fight. Because I'm not going to have someone forced to do something. This way, everyone has a chance in combat. Not that it's going to be an easy fight, but you know. Resolute, really, dude. I am so surprised at these two. Not that they can do anything, but I am surprised at these two. And Dismas absolutely has to keep the real one from Hero. Okay, and she really can't do too much. So let's... He's going to do more damage, I think. In conclusion. And see if I can't get rid of this guy. Well, I'm okay, Para, heal yourself. Don't need you dying. Although that's gonna become. Yeah, I should have just attacked. There's too much damage going on there. Um, Duelist advanced. Now he'll die on his turn. Now I got three left. She has to go at the dog. But she died for it. She understood death, but could not defy it. Don't think Dismas is getting out of this one, guys. Our only hope is to one-shot him. <laughs> and they went for the corpse. Okay, he can't hit either of them from there. So, take aim to get the dodge and crit. Stupendous. And the motor guy can't hit him. Huh. One less obstacle in our path. Oh, and the burning got dismissed. That was so close. Oh, man. Well, another scuffed run, but and you will yet in its own way, that was kind of funny and fun. Surprised I got 30 candles for that. I should have just taken the bounty hunter. Learn from your mistakes. All I can say. Almost got quite a bit of uh, extra candles for getting people to the end. So we will... Uh... Pick up from there next time, try cowardice again, seeing if I can actually get my butt to the mountain. But as you can see, after these past two runs, no promises. Uh, things happen, as you can see. 
maybe I'm setting my sight to too high after that first run, but uh, yeah, we, we will get there, but it, it may take some time, so all right, I hope you're all enjoying these. Uh, let me know your thoughts on it, um, if I should just uh, keep posting these as is, or if you want me to just see if I can finally get to the mountain and post that run, so... Um, I'm enjoying doing these, but if you ju guys just want to see the run to the mountain, let me know. But that's it for this time. As always, I wish you all well. I'll see you next time, and please have a good one.